This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. I flooded the roads myself to strand you here in a fight for your life. Only one of you will survive. The rest of you will die. Was that clear? I'm trying to be a better communicator. Okay, first question. Where does the movie Casablanca take place? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Well, that's no fun. Let's keep moving. How many eggs does an American alligator lay at once? Who picked this? The rest of you, it's time. Housekeeping! We're at room 105. I hope you like magic tricks. Pick a space inside the box to hide. When this was used in magic shows, there were safeguards inside to prevent injury. But don't worry, I took those out. Any good magic trick needs some helpful volunteers. Now, can you confirm that we've never met before? <laughs> Just kidding. A little magician banter. You get a sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your sword through. Ugh, I feel underdressed. I should have worn a tuxedo or something. Slice, slice! Aw, oh, man. I always want to just push all the buttons. But don't worry, I'll stay focused. Let's try another one. What do you call the electronic musical instrument that makes those... ...sounds? Who picked... ...this? The rest of you, follow me. Welcome to room 237. Let's roll them bones. Roll as much as you want to add to your score. I'll kill the player with the lowest score. But go over 21 and you die instead. And don't forget, if they roll a skull, that adds one to everyone's score. This is a game for people who like blackjack, but hate using cards. Time's almost up. Looks like you didn't roll enough. Ah! 
You're not going anywhere. You're a ghost now. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Let's keep moving. How long did alcohol prohibition last in the United States? seen that. Let's try another one. Why are there holes in my Swiss cheese? And no, that's not a euphemism. Only you. Come with me. It's the pegs game. You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. You know what? We need some death zones. Go ahead, everyone else. Choose a slot to make it no bueno. Okay, let the games begin. It's so hard to predict what will happen. Ayo, you know what this means. Players left alive will go to the final round. Next question. Where was the first subway system? show you something. We're going to play with mirrors. Oh, hey, look! The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. Pay attention to her unique handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will all the safe players. Draw a word on the mirror, and maybe you'll trick someone into thinking it's Aunt Mildred's. Go ahead and start writing. Pay attention to the words as they appear and try to spot my auntie. So many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. Enter the right word now, or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Looks like there's no fooling you. Aren't you special? You know what that means. Let's keep moving. The 3rd of May is a famous Goya painting that depicts what historical event? this. 
time for consequences. I'm going to give you a chance to password protect your life. Enter a real four-letter word with your device. Don't make it easy. If someone cracks your password, you die. Now everyone else will try to crack the password. As a team, guess the password on your device. You get a clue if your guess has a letter in the right spot. If anyone figures out the password before time runs out, I will reward you all. This is a team effort, so share clues out loud with each other. I hope you do a better job with your bank account password. Someday I'm gonna be famous, even if it's just on the internet. Let's try another one. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Whose law is this? Who picked this? Welp, didn't want that to happen. Let's keep moving. What's almost always flavored with juniper berries? It's real simple. The player who rolls the highest will die. But we've got some help to make this more interesting. You have an extra die that you can give to whoever you want to make their odds worse. Look at that dice collection! Now roll! The player with the highest total dies. The actual dying will probably be less painful than being singled out for the extra dice. I forgot I have dinner reservations. We need to wrap this up. Okay, this is a game where only one person can survive, so... I hope you don't mind a little water. Only one of these keys will open the lock to your tank. So many keys to choose from. Far so bad. Choose another key. Oh, I just remembered that I have oxygen tanks in storage. Sorry. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive. But will you be the one to escape? I'm going to give you a category. Animals and Animal Farm. Tap each answer that fits the cat. Let's see the right answers. You move forward one space for each correct answer. You're on your way to escaping. Ah, but it's not just you. 
If a ghost catches you, they'll steal your life force. Then they can try to escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Time is almost up. Kind of a gimme. Next question. Fortnite skins. Endocrine glands. Here comes the darkness. Worn around the neck. Time is almost up. A lot of lucky guesses. That ghost can smell your life force. Galaxies. what I had in mind. The tables have turned. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, not so fast. You need a perfect answer for your final escape. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. Time is almost up. to escape. Four stolen life force. Fuck the brands.